Oh, what? I got one hit. Arrowhead scammed me. In a good way. But let's get back right to that in a minute. I really wanted marksman weapons to be a part of some of my builds, but seeing that the ones that we have are lackluster in terms of damage and ammo, also not to mention the scope that are just... Ugh. I just can't make them work. I mean, the closest one that I use that functions like a DMR is the Scorcher, and that is not even classified as a marksman weapon. But now, we have the Adjudicator, a fine new addition to the Helldiver's arsenal. The Adjudicator is the first weapon that you can get from the new Democratic Demolition Premium War Bond. It is classified as a marksman weapon, but it has the full auto option in its fire modes. Hence my statement earlier why I said I was scammed, because I for sure thought it was going to be another typical marksman weapon and I was ready for it. I thought in the trailer that the guy using it just had godlike tapping abilities. Okay, let's check this weapon out. So firstly, uh, you have an ammo capacity of 25 in the mag. You have two fire options or uh, fire modes. You have semi and auto. Semi is obviously your tap shots. And your full auto is obviously your spray and pray. Oh. In terms of scope, it has three scopes. You have 25 meters. 50 meters. And you're 100 meters. Now, why I think that the Adjudicator is better is not because of its full auto option, but because of its scope. I just think it's much cleaner than its sniper counterparts. Against automatons, I have to say that I was impressed. I immediately fell in love with the weapon. It's so strong that you have the option to panic spray at close range when you're getting mobbed by the berserkers and rank and file grunts you can just mag dump them and get profit now of course since it's still a marksman weapon the ammo economy is not the best so i'd refrain from depending on full auto alone devastators get three to four hits on the head before they go down and of course since it's a primary even though it has medium penetration it's on the lower scale so you can't really destroy hulks by hitting the eye up front. With the scout striders, you have the option to fire in their hip area to destroy their vehicle, but in my opinion, because of your low ammo capacity, I just shoot the popping head on the top if you don't have the option to hit them from the back. It still functions as a typical medium penetrating primary like the Liberator Penetrator, but with higher damage output and slightly lower ammo. For the terminated side, it performed well in terms of tearing the mediums apart, but of course, we all know how bug missions go and how frequent the spawns are. The ammo economy just can't keep up. Hive guards, rude commanders, stalkers, they all go down quick. Just a quick spray and pray, they all die. Now what I tried is, I used it like how I used the slugger. I ran with Guard Dog Rover so that it would take care of the smaller chaff units for me and just focus on the mediums. I gotta say, it worked like a charm. It's a solid option if you want to mix it up a little with your primary and your loadouts, but just keep in mind you're gonna be fighting for ammo most of the time. When fighting the Shriekers, this weapon has some kick to it and again, the ammo doesn't help, so spamming when trying to kill the flyers is a no-no. I would suggest trying to take your time when shooting them down. And just like any other primary in the game, it doesn't do much against the chargers and the bile titans, so just stick to your anti-heavy assets. I love this weapon. Well, maybe not too much, since it suffers in the ammo department. And with my playstyle, that's usually gung-ho, it holds me back a little bit. But then again, if a weapon is everything, no one would use other weapons. I'd give this weapon a solid A, maybe, just because it's fun to use and strong enough to be viable. But of course, don't hesitate to let me know about your thoughts and what possible builds you guys have in mind. I hope this video was helpful and informative enough to let you know what this weapon does. 
I am going to try out the next weapons and hopefully can give you another video about what they're capable of and probably discuss some builds with you guys. Well, with all that said, go back to spreading freedom, Helldivers.